So today I decided we're gonna stop by Target. I'm not expecting to find anything on my list here because it usually is a lot of newer stuff and I'm looking for some older things, but hopefully they stock that we can find something cool on the shelves. So it doesn't look like they really stocked over here that recently. Um, a lot of these Full Art Ninja Turtles, uh, they don't seem to be selling very well, but they do have those here. Got a Ginny Weasley from Harry Potter. It's a pretty cool one. I also like these Hobgoblins. These are uh, only at Target. They're pretty cool looking, but other than that, um, nothing really here I'm interested in. There's Fuzzy Lumpkins for all you Powerpuff Girl fans. But we'll have to... Uh, Hit up another store, see what we can find. So I was walking through the stuffed animal section and I happened to see this out of place Wally and Eve 2 pack. It is a only a Target exclusive. Unfortunately, it's a little banged up, so we're not gonna get it today, but it is a really nice two pack. We will definitely have to add it to our list and keep an eye out for it in the future. All right, so we just left Target and right down the street, there is a Zia Records here in Mesa, Arizona. I've heard that there is a pop section, so we're gonna head inside and we're gonna see what they have. So there isn't a ton here that I'm interested in getting, but there are some cool things to point out. Uh, you got Fluffy from Despicable Me. That's a special edition pop. That's kind of cute. What else do we got? Beef Squatch for all you Bob's Burger fans out there. Um, there's a bunch of Simpsons characters. So if you like those, you want to come on down and pick those up while you can. This one's kind of cool. This is a Disney exclusive. This is Smee. It's a really well done pop. Um, what else? Oof. Ron with Baxter. That's Ron Burgundy from Anchorman. That is a 2020 summer convention exclusive. That's pretty cool. But like I said, nothing here I'm going to be picking up today. I did get notified that there is a pop-up Funko convention not too far from here. So we're going to head down there and see if we can find anything to uh, pick up for the day. So we just left Sia Records and I got this flyer sent to me for the Pop Swap which is a local marketing event for people to basically set up tables and sell their pops if they want. And fortunately, it's right over by our last stop of the day, which is the Brass Armadillo. That's an antique shop here in town. We're gonna go there first, then we're gonna hit up this pop swap, see what we can find. So we're at our first case. Axel Rose back there. Got a Hot Topic exclusive Alice Cooper. A lot of musicians up here. Let's see what else they got. A lot of newer pops. Got Boo in there. Monsters Inc. fans. Got some Pokemon stuff. And uh, let's see what's over here. A lot of sports stuff. Uh, Arizona Cardinals, we are in Arizona, so not surprising, but a lot of different players from a lot of different teams. Got some basketball stuff up here. Got a good amount of football stuff. Pretty much pops for any team you may be a fan of. Got some wrestling stuff down at the bottom. Over here we have an open section of Star Wars stuff. As you can see, they have a lot of the Valentine's Day stuff in. Valentine's Day is approaching pretty quickly. Got a Chase Porg in here. Pretty much anything to satisfy the needs of a Star Wars fan. These are pretty cool. It's a nice three pack. That was a Walmart exclusive. There is a mix of random pops just in numerous places, but a lot of other toys. Looks like we have a pop section over here. Everything from Ray. Got some other Star Wars stuff, some DC stuff from The Flash. 
Gotham 007 we got down here stuff from Doctor Strange spy Groot that's pretty cool that's why I enjoy going to antique shops there's really a nice mix of different things and you never really know what you're gonna find so it's always fun to come across something cool unique different you may not see in stores regularly Finished up at the antique shop and we're on our way to our last stop of the day, the Pop Swap. Well, we didn't get anything to cross off the list today, but I did pick up these three figures at the pop swap that we went to. We got Goku Black, who is my favorite villain in the Dragon Ball Super series. We also got the PX Previews exclusive Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. Kind of a mouthful, but it's a really nice looking pop. Glad to add it to my Dragon Ball collection. And then, of course, the Hot Topic exclusive Fused Zamasu. So these will be uh, great additions to my collection. That's all the hunting we're doing today. Thanks everybody for watching the video. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at az underscore pop hunter, and we will see you next time. Whoa!